this is Johnny Guppy. Welcome back to Life is Strange. We just did this, so I'm talking over it, so we're not missing too much. Um, yeah. Shit's going down. I'm being really aggressive toward me. Do you think Max will be pissed with Brittany on her desk? Oh, I'm sure she'll avoid a circus I'm already sitting. We'll show Brendan if her desk is tiny. Let him get this shit. Um, I'm already sitting here. I think I broke the game again. I got a message from Chloe. <laughs> Fuck that shady loop. So I guess I'm going to elope with Chloe now. Okay. Hi, Mom. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing right now. Or stopped it is a better way to say it. She can't die. She can't die. She can't die. I gotta get up there. Fucking birds. Fucking birds. Fuck the birds. Fuck the birds. Fuck the fuck 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 the birds. Okay, now what do I do? I'm up here. So, oh, I gotta go inside and walk up? Oh my god, what? No, she can't die, I've worked so hard. Come on. Here, Max. Stop! Don't come near me. Not now. It won't work. 
you. You come to get another Pulitzer shot like yesterday, Max? <sighs> I wanted proof. I only wanted proof that David was harassing me. More like you wanted another shot to the max cost of crap up. You want another now? Huh? Shit. No. Please, Kate. You know me better than that. And I know you don't want to jump. But I do. My life is already over. Kate, your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. You are such a liar. You wanted to help by ignoring my phone calls? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. It was in silent when my phone died. It was Chloe. I thought it was Lauren. Uh Um I was with Chloe. I was with Chloe and she was having a serious problem too. I'm sorry. Apparently her problem is worse than mine. So I even bothered you. I'm done anyway. Fuck no! Oh, oh I fucked up. And with that, we're going to reload the last checkpoint. I think I can save her. Shit. I don't know if I can, though. I think I ignored her too much. I don't know. I don't know what to say. What are you doing here, Max? Stop! Don't come near me. Calm down. Won't work. I don't have any power. Can I have the unit by myself? Did you come to get another <laughs> Pulitzer shot like yesterday, Max? <laughs> I was scared. I'm so sorry. I thought I could help, but not by leaking a picture. I'm ashamed. I know you're scared of David. He's scary. And I know you only want to help. I let you down, and I'm sorry. I only want to help you. I wish you could. It's too late now. There's nothing for me here anymore. But hey, <laughs> your life is still yours. And we can get through this together. Let me help. You are such a liar. You wanted to help by ignoring my phone calls? I swear, it was in silent mode, and I didn't see it. Or I totally would have answered. I needed you to answer, Max. Everybody thinks I'm a viral slut now. There is no everyone. There's only your friends and your family who love you. Kate, please trust me. Come stand by me, okay? I can help you now. I know I can. This morning I erased the left word from the video. It was written on the shower room mirror. Are you serious? Thank you so much. The fact that you only care about that video and would come up here to stop me means a lot. <laughs> you were drugged. I care about you because I believe you were drugged. We will find out who did this and make them pay. Sounds so persuasive, Max. Hey, I believe you. Will you believe me? Please, you don't have to do this. Max, I'm in a nightmare and I can't wake up. I'm living through myself completely. And then everybody at Blackwell is going sick with my body. We're working on the internet forever. What do they call it? A web? Nothing can ever get out. Like my video. I wish I could go back in time and erase everything. Uh. Hey, this is our chance. 
only really went against them. Really, Dad? I don't believe in miracles anymore, either. Now I do. You're part of the reason why. If you come down to me, I can tell you more. You're such a good person, Dad. Even if you're full of crap. But I'll come with you. Yep! You're my friend. I did it! Forever. Can we hug on you? Father. Hey, Chris, of course you're wrong. You think he cares about a video? He loves you unconditionally. Dad does care, even though I hurt him. He's the only one I know who believes in me. I did it. 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 Now I know today was difficult for the family, but I'm so proud that they brought their crew together to save the Empress Palm. Of course, you're quite the hero for getting Kate to come down. I didn't kill her. She's mine, Sam. Like a real hero. Yeah, real hero. As principal of Blackwell Academy, I take my duty seriously. I take the well-being of every student more seriously. What happened today should never happen in the Hall of Wisdom and Knowledge. Mm -hmm. Mr. Masters, as our head of security, those brute boys should always be off. That's just standard operating procedure. They were not. And that is indeed your responsibility. Mr. Jefferson? I know you can't be expected to know what your students are going through, but Kate has assisted you in class, so you should have known something was missing. Mr. Prescott, since you are responsible for the Vortex bus crisis, and since Miss Mars is here to tend your lab, you'll have to answer some more questions. Yes! It's all coming together. Miss Carson, why exactly were you on the roof with Kate Mars? Did she tell you her plan? Or anything at all? Please. Oh god, this is gonna be juicy. Nathan Doster, Jefferson made her cry. Oh fuck. Oh my god, what do I choose? What do I choose? I don't know. I don't, I do not know what I should choose. I don't know what I should choose. I don't know what I choose. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. You know what, I've been sticking with Nathan the whole entire time, so... Nathan it is. Alright, Ms. Oldfield, please stand here so we can ceremoniously hold up 
I'll continue this investigation in secret. You are the strongest. Um, I'm just gonna sign it. I'm sticking with this. I'm gonna stick with Nathan. He's going down. Down, down, down. Down to Crazy Town. Well, I think we know less now than when we saw. You'll be assisting the police with further investigations. I know this has been a stressful day. Uh huh. I wish I had the power to change it all for the better. So thank you. Well, shit. Now what? Freddy. I couldn't even believe it could happen. It was literally slow motion every time it happened. And I had to see it happen in front of my eyes. Yeah, that was the greatest thing I've ever seen, ever. Reached out, she reached out, hugs, tears, applause, like a superhero. I look at you. I'm a mess. You're glowing. Seriously, a human halo. I'm pretty sure you earned your wings today. Aww. I'm so worried about Kate. She did try to kill herself. All over a video. Viral is the right word. I didn't see. So you watched it? Just one. One and a half times. Why? I don't mean to sound weird, but there's something ominous going on at Black Box. Today proves that. And I'm working on proof that Kate Marsh is connected to Rachel Amber. Somehow. Along with Nathan and Mr. Madsen. I'm not a big conspiracy guy, but I wouldn't doubt it. Nathan did scare me yesterday, and Madsen is a straight up dickhead. So, what do you think is really happening? What the hell is this? Whoever confirms this weird taste, I feel that chill. Max, there was no eclipse schedule today. I wouldn't know. I would. Aww. <laughs> I believe you, Mark. I believe anything this way. Shit's getting real. I'm kind of glad Frank didn't die. Wow.
you kind of need to evacuate the town. But I think the tornado is created because her, of her overuse of her powers. Something's horrible, horrible, horrible. Uh oh. Kelly or KJ? That was awesome. It's getting real. Like, seriously real. Oh, I'm so happy and giddy at the same time. Oh my god, that was a good episode. Good, just a good thing. Oh, it's all coming to a head. Next one's gonna be even worse, and I know it's going to be even worse, but I'm gonna love it. I was able to save Kate, though. I know I was able to. I did not want her to die. I could have let her die. I did not want her to die. Unless, ugh. Never mind, I'm not even going to mention that, because that's a huge spoiler in the Season 2 of The Walking Dead series, and if you haven't played it, I ain't going to say it. So, ah, I'm excited. So many more questions. Could I actually started to suspect that, um, oh, uh, even though, despite Mr. Jefferson being a really, really good guy so far, he could actually be the bad guy, because he had a close relationship with Kate, and, uh, Rachel, but at the same time, Rachel might still be alive, she's just missing, possibly kidnapped. Nathan has issues to begin with, whether or not he did drug her up Kate or not, so that's going to be a thing. Mr. Madsen has problems. I think he's what he's trying to do is good, but at the same time, what he said was wrong. He made it sound like she wa he wanted Kate to die. Why would he want to have wanted, have wanted Kate to die? That's just wrong. But oh well. We'll have to figure that in the next episode. So thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you like this video, please leave a comment, like, and subscribe. It means the world to me. Um, just damn. That was amazing. This will be the Joan and Guppy signing off with episode 2 of The Life is Strange. Bye!